know you all know I paint, and I have a website and a Redbubble store where I sell prints of my work. And I know that choosing between all the options can be a bit daunting, so I wanted to show you some of them and tell you what they are. This one is a metal print. As you can see, it's very glossy, it's thick, and it, and it has a float mount hanging system. This one is called Journey to the Low Hills. Now this piece is printed on watercolor paper. The original painting has a lot of texture, so as you can see, this paper is very textured. Uh, this is nice and thick as well, so it will hold up very well. And this painting is called Goldenrod, and it comes from my memories of Crow Hill when I was growing up. This next one is my version of the fairy Melusine from the French legends. And she has been spied on by the king who sees that she is actually a mermaid. And once she knows he has caught her, she turns into a dragon and she flies away. This is on smooth, fine art paper, Hanamule cotton rag. Nice paper. This next piece is called Foxes, and it is printed on watercolor paper, just like uh, the goldenrod piece is. And this is a very sturdy paper, and it's really a nice texture. I think of her as a fox shaman or a were fox. This next one is called Kindred, and it is on semi-gloss paper or Epson semi-matte paper, but on my website, I call it semi-gloss paper. So it's very smooth and shows the inks very well. Now this next one is the Barn Owl piece and it is on Glossy paper, Mitsubishi glossy photo paper, and it is really beautiful. If you can't afford a metal print, this is your next best thing. Of course, you'd have to frame it, but these are all standard sizes. You can buy frames on Amazon if you need to. This one is a hare or a jackrabbit called the smell of wild carrots, which are also called Queen Anne's Lace. And it is also on the Epson semi-gloss paper. And I think it looks really beautiful on this paper. And then I have the large 16 by 20 print of my painting procession. And this is on smooth fine art paper, Kodak smooth fine art paper. And it's very beautiful. And the original has a lot of metallic paint in it. So if you're up for an original, this one really glistens and gleams in the light. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.